you are a witch. You call my mother a witch? <laughs> you call my mother a witch? Ever, please, ever. You call my mother a witch? Ever, 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 please, please. to me. Why are they running from me? What has it done for you? What has it done for you? I am telling you, this man has hurt so many girls out there. Are you here telling me the man, your, your brother is a pastor? But Susie, won't the native doctor's charm have a negative effect? Which negative effect? I did not tell you the man is going to give you a love passion to trap a man. All I said is going to divine for you. Tell you the origin and the cause of your problem. I want to do to break them. That is all. Susie, are you sure? No. She died there. <laughs> Pastor, you make me laugh. Mr. Adams, this is not a laughing matter. You see, your wife complained to me about your excessive drinking habit and how it's affecting her children and uh, their education. <laughs> Please, Pastor, wait. My wife reported me to you. Yes, she did. She complained about your excessive drinking habit. So, so you are advising me to stop? Yes. But, Pastor, charity begins at home. Your, your brother, your elder brother, the doctor, it's a member of our drinking club. Have you advised him? Uh, <laughs> does it really matter? Remove the speck in your eyes. So you will see clearly to remove the stick in another man's eyes. You see, all these things are happening because you all have refused to dedicate your lives to Christ. Confess your sins to Him. 
Invite him as your Lord and personal Savior, and he will wipe away your sins. You see, Jesus said, Come, come to me, all you that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. What your daughter-in-law Winnie said to you is not surprising. Because the Bible lets us know in the book of Proverbs, chapter 10, verse 14, that out of the mouth of the fool comes rain. And the same Bible lets us know in the book of James, chapter 3, verse 10, that out of the same mouth comes praise and curse. So, take heart, Mama. Just bear in mind that these are the devices of the evil one. But remember that this Bible here tells us that no weapon, no weapon whatsoever fashioned against us shall prosper. So Mama, take heart. Junior, where's your mommy? She's in the room. Go and call her, please. Nephi, do you want to tell me that you did not see me, your mother, sitting down here? Nephi! Ah, Nephi, really? I was just passing by, so I said, let me stop. I want to see you. Let me see your face. Oh, okay. okay. Go inside and wait for your mom. Come, come, come. Do you know that it is true that Mama is a witch? When Auntie Ethel told us, nobody believed her. Hmm. This, my friend here, took me to a strong native doctor. Not only did he confirm that Mama is a witch, he also confirmed that Mama is responsible for my inability to get a husband. Oh, when I told her, she never believed me. That is not all. He also said that Mama's witchcraft is what pushes water into drinking and that she and her fellow witches ensures that Abel cannot establish his own church. But if you tell them, they will never agree. They'll say, how can a mother turn against her own children? It's good you've seen it with your own eyes. But this word is funny. How could your mother do this to you? I don't know. Look at me, 32 years old. I don't have a husband. Don't worry. When your brother comes back today and he does not drive her away from the house, I'll simply take my kids and, give, and go away. After all, witches and human, they never live together. Mm -mm. Um, Winnie, I'll, I'll see you. I have to go. Okay, bye-bye. Okay. Okay. Why is Mama not eating with us? Because I told her to start packing. Why? Because witches and human beings don't live under the same roof. Look, Winifred, I can see that the demon that possesses you has returned. And if you don't take time, I will beat it out of you tonight if you don't if you continue calling my mother a witch. She is a witch. She is a witch. Even your sister, if you confirm that this afternoon at the native doctor's place. If you say she's no one, let her go there and see if she will not confess. Shut up. Shut up your mouth. It is your mother. Your father. Your family. They are the witches. They must go to the native doctor to confess. What is wrong with you at all? Do you know how that woman suffered to take care of us? 
And after that same woman turned around to bewitch the same children. All I know is that she's a witch. Now you get out of here. Get out of here before I get you. Porcupine. Hmm? Have you thought about what you're saying? Have you weighed what you're saying, Evie? You mean Mama who suffered emotionally, physically, and psychologically to take care of us? Will not turn around to bewitch her own children? To achieve what? For what purpose? Brother, I don't know for what purpose. All I know is that if we go to the native doctor and he does not confirm it, then we shall know. Confirm what? Confirm what? I am ready to stake my life. If Mama does not confess at the native doctor's place that she's a witch, that she's responsible for my inability to get a husband. Brother, you've said it yourself. You don't know why you drink. Let's just go there first and see. Effie. Effie. If you are not a witch, Go to the native doctor's place. And if I go there and nothing happens, what would you do? Go there first. Go there first. And if nothing happens to you, then my name ceases to be winning. I'm not afraid to go to your native doctor's shrine. But if I go there and nothing happens. And if something happens. All right. I will go. And I'll prove. All of you wrong. Which? my head. In return, I will not avoid the shit in your anus and bite your buttocks. A woman who sells a cat and replaces it with a dog is still in possession of an animal that sits down always. And a goat that thinks because it has four legs and goes to play with lions soon discovers the difference between a finger and a claw. <laughs> Tell Alfred Ball what you want. I stand accused by my daughter and my daughter-in-law. I am accused of witchcraft, but I am not a witch. Yet, if I be a witch, do to me as you will. Very well, Swan. 
of Red Devil! With her own mouth, she has invoked you! Woman! On your right is the black circle. And on your left, the red circle is the circle of guilty. Step into anyone you like. Stop into it! Responsible for my first son's drunkenness. I make sure my second son cannot establish his church. I do not want my daughter to get married. So I turn the eyes of men away from her. I am a witch. Mother! I am a witch. I am a witch. <laughs> I am a witch. Travel out of town. Besides, I don't think we are ready to take a confessed switch into our house. So I advise you to get out. Beatrice, who is that? <laughs> who else? It's your mother. My mother? Why is she looking like this? And what is she doing outside? Oh, you've not heard, eh? Your other brother took her to a native doctor where she confessed that her witchcraft is responsible for the wolves and misfortunes you are passing through. God! Mama? 
Mama, what happened to you? Why are you looking like this? What about Walter? I don't know, I know. I don't understand. It's all right, Mama. Come, come, let's go inside. Sorry, Isabel. Will you shut up and leave the door? into this house. Oh, my thing. <laughs>
This is your wife. This is your school fees. This is your pocket money. Please, my son, use it judiciously. I have sold all my robbers. I've sold my wedding ring just to pay your school fees. Please, I beg you, read your books. Remember that you have no father. No uncle, no aunt, anywhere except God. She said. God bless you, my son. Yes, my son. I said no! Was it something? 